Hey guys, today for this tutorial what we're going to do is a simple way to embed an mp3 player into your website with a single song using Dreamweaver CS4. This is a very simple tutorial. I spent hours trying to figure out how to do this, racking my brain and pulling my hair out, so I hope this helps for you guys. This is pretty much made for people like me that are stuck on stupid and just need simplicity and not all that drama behind it. So the first thing that I'm going to do is I'm going to find the song in which I want to embed on my website. I already have iTunes opened up and I know which song I want. I'm in my music library and I'm going to enter center field because this is going on to my baseball website. So here's my center field. I can play it. Make sure that that's the song I want. I know it is. All I have to do now is click it, drag it to my desktop, and there it is. I'm going to minimize iTunes. I'm actually, because only because I've already done this on my website, I'm going to rename this. This is something you will not have to do. But since I've already done this and I'm doing this for the tutorial, I'm going to rename it so I don't get a replace or duplication issue. Next thing I'm going to do is open up Dreamweaver, which I already have done. So Dreamweaver is open, and I need to put my song onto the website. And I've already done that here, so what I'm going to do is show you how to do it on your own. I'm going to open up a new page for the tutorial, and I can see my cursors right here. I have everything set on my layout.css to center all my script and it's going to also center my mp3 player. And you can see my flashing cursor and that's where I want to go ahead and put my song. Um, first thing I want to do is actually get my song onto Dreamweaver and I should have showed you that earlier but we're going to do it now. So here's my folder for my website. It's labeled angels. This is where everything for my site goes. This is where all my HTML is. If you've gotten this far and you're trying to put a song in, then you've already got this. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to click on my song out here. I'm just going to drop it anywhere inside my folder. I'm going to close that out. Go back into Dreamweaver. And I'm going to look for the song in which I dropped. Boom. There it is. There's the song. You can see I changed it to center field three. Now the next thing I need to do is create a media folder. I already did that here, but for the tutorial, I'm going to go ahead and rename it. So first thing I need to do is I need to click over here on my site folder, click new folder, and for this purpose, I'm gonna label it media two because I already have one. And I'm gonna click on the song and I'm oh, and I'm gonna drag it up into my media 2 file right there so we have it into our media 2 file so we're good on that next thing I want to do is place my cursor in the position of wherever I want my player to be so that's gonna be up to you guys anywhere on your website where you want to place your cursor is where your player is gonna be I'm going to put it up here just because it's simple for people to be able to turn on and turn off. Next thing, since I know my cursor is flashing, and if I go into my split code, I can see right where I'm at, where my cursor is at. And I'm going to go to Insert, Media Objects, or Media, and I'm going to go all the way down to Plugin. Now, here's my song. That's not quite the one that I had already picked. I mean, that's just showing me from my previous. So, anyways, you're going to go with what it shows you with media. I'm just doing this because I've already done it. Media 2, I found my song. I'm going to click highlight my song, choose it, and you can see we have a little plug-in adapter, which is the same as this little guy right here. It looks like a little, pu like a little puzzle piece. So that's our plugin adapter. That's going to put our song and make our song play. I'm going to save this and show you a problem we're going to have, but 
it's a small problem. I'm going to open up the website. We can see it's playing. I can pause. The song's on there. Piece of cake. Walk in the park. Here's a little player. But the problem is, it's a little player. So let's make that player a little bit bigger. I'm going to close it. And come back to Dreamweaver. And here's my plugin. If I come down to the bottom left here under my page pro or under my properties panel, I'm going to see all this good stuff over here. I'm going to see my width and height. Let's change the width on this to 225. That's what I like. I'm going to hit Command S or Control S on a PC. I'm going to save it. I'm going to go back and do my preview. I'm going to preview it in Firefox. And now I can see that I have a bigger player here. I can go ahead and pause it. I can click and hold the click button. My right click and move the volume controls up and down. Play it. Pause it. Whatever. We've got a nice little player here. Walk in the park. That was, I don't think it gets any simpler than that from anything I've ever watched. I haven't found one that goes this easy as far as how to put a single song onto a website. And we did that in probably less than five minutes. I don't know. <clears throat> um, this is my second tutorial ever doing. Guys, I thank you very much for watching it. Um, I wish I could give you more information on what to do, but I think this is pretty much it. Um, I know that there you can find ways of doing, um, if you don't want it to play, on boot then you can do a false you can add a false but you know there's different way there there's a, an easy way of doing it anyhow I'm not going to get into that on this tutorial because I want to upload this and just show you how easy it is to do it the users can go in there and they can click the pause button if they don't want to hear it anyhow hey thanks for watching the tutorial it's my second tutorial please comment on it let me know if I'm doing all right what have you it only take two seconds to comment on it um, please do so because I want to get some feedback on maybe what I can do different. Anyhow, thanks guys. Um, hope you enjoyed it.